welcome back to my channel. I hope that you are having a fantastic day. I sure am. And I wanted to, if I sound far away, because I stepped away for a second, I wanted to do another unboxing with you guys from a company, uh, Lola Rose, oh, there it is, Diamonds. I got my trusty box cutter in my hand, because uh, I did not take the time to at least cut this open. And it's okay. Um, on the box here, it says thank you, and with the little stickers, and fragile handle with care, fragile, <laughs> handle with care, thank you, and it says that again, a little upside down here, but that is all that was on here other than the shipping information, so I'm just going to stop rambling and get on with the unboxing. Um, I can't remember who I saw unboxing at Lola Rose. Ooh! Like every, people's um, diamond painting unboxing just kind of blur together. So I got a nice little card here, Sarah. This is for my eyes only. If I want you to see it, I'll let you see it. Okay, does say hello. Okay, cool. So we got some stickers in here. Uh, little sloth, be happy, listening to music. Oh, that's cute. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Another sloth hugging a pineapple. He's so happy. And a flamingo. I'm loving that these um these uh, business owners are. Hold on. <laughs> Actually, no, come back. Where did it fall to? Oh, I see it. Give me one second. Okay. So it's actually two stickers, but it's still cute though. <laughs> okay. And it just says, um, I know you're going to love Bohemian Soul. Thank you for your order and support. I'm not going to lie. I don't know the, the, the signature. I'm assuming it's the same person. I'm sorry. I can't, I don't, I don't, I don't know who that is. XOXO, hugs and kisses. I like that. Thank you. Yeah, these stickers are so cute. So I kind of gave it away with the um, the information that was on the card. No big deal. Oh, fancy. Uh, so we got a little, I don't even know what this material is called, but a little pouch, a little mesh pouch. Of goodies as well so this looks like a little container to put your wax in your earrings small stud earrings uh, candy glue I, I don't know but a little container here some pink wax some washi tape this looks like silver stars a little sticker here and that's what we have bohemian soul uh, this is a round 24 by 36 or 60 by 90 25 colors including one a B score and it is legally licensed more stickers yay and what is this oh just a, a Lola Rose card uh, just saying thank you I was wondering if it had like a code on there to get some stuff. I'm not giving you my code if it was on there. <laughs> okay, I'll worry about that later. So let's get into the meats and potatoes. Oh, there is one more thing in there, but that's my shipping information. It's wrapped up in this beautiful tissue paper. And I, for one, do save my tissue paper if I don't tear it for, um, for just gift wrapping. You know what? I'm not too perfect with the unwrapping of the tissue paper, but again, I'm gonna at least try to keep this. So this is pretty, it's got like little confetti sparkles on it. Okay. Who else saves there? Oh no, it's on my bed. <laughs> just, it's like, Glitter. Once you once it's stuck on something, you can't really get it off. All right. So this is really well packaged. I love it. Let's 
go ahead and pull out the good stuff. So here is the inventory sheet. It says it right there, I didn't make that up. <laughs> and so here we are. Looks like we have, well, I said it earlier, 25 colors and one AB. And let's look at the canvas. Ooh, she's, ooh, chow, she is big. <laughs> okay, let's move all this stuff out of here. And let's roll her back. And it's okay to do this because it's poured glue. I might have to stick her between my mattress. All right. Can you see all of her? It's this side over here, but not much is happening because it's... Oh my gosh, she is beautiful. I love this. I love the hair and the hoop earring. Oh, you look so beautiful. I wonder if you know that already. You should, you know that by now. <laughs> um, as I was unrolling, I noticed some goodie bags with, looks about the same thing. So I'm just gonna open one. Although you guys are privy to all of this uh, same stuff. Uh-oh. Looks like it cracked. That's so cool though. Um, little white boats, some baggies, some flimsy tweezers, and a pink pen with a single uh, multi-placer tip. I wonder if the other one looks like that too. Yeah, it does. No big deal. Seriously, it's seriously no big deal to me. I've just never seen it like this, although it is kind of cold where I am at the time of recording. So that might have been the reason. So let's get into the canvas. Wow. I love, I'm really digging the hair and I love the shape of the face and the eye. I don't know what else to say about this. I'm really, really excited. I've done a lot of long painting, Oops, not a lot, a few, uh, a couple, I don't know how many long ones but never wide ones. So this is gonna be interesting. Um, if you guys could see my workstation, I think you've seen it before in a in a uh, container unboxing. That is how I work. <laughs> but looks like a lot of neutral colors, which I love. I love neutrals. I love uh, skin tones and It's very, I don't want to call it simple and basic, but I think neutrals really go with anything depending on what you pair it with. But here we go. Instead of uh, individual baggies, we have the strip and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. So we'll just start with these here. We'll start at the end. Looks like we have, uh, what is that? I was reading this. I was like, we have 24. So this is number 24, uh, 3856. And then our AB 127, which is like a uh, a pale pink. It's really, my lighting is really terrible right now, but that's kind of what we're working with right now. And the iridescent coating, which just makes it glisten and sparkle and shine just a tad bit more than this so i think that's a really pretty color Put that there all right got some purples 33 37 uh 38 24 30 uh 37 70 got one two three four five six, seven of those, and then uh, 37, 
Do, 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 do. Oh. <laughs> Let's turn you over. Uh, 3326, 3340, we have one, two of those, 3341, and 3731. Let's take a quick look at these as well. Like a pumpkin color. This is pink. It looks pale pink by my phone's, uh, whatever that's called, but in... In real life, it's like a, a standard pink color. So far, so good with the um, drill quality. All right. I kind of went, it looks like I'm out of order. All right. So we have 712, 745, 754. We got one, two of those. 814, 920, 947. 951. Hmm. That's interesting. I have two 951s, but they are completely different colors. So I may have to reach out about this. Um, and we'll take a look at the canvas as well. I'm not really sure which is the correct one, but... Let's hold off for a little bit. Actually, I'm going to shove that up there so I don't mix it with the other ones. I have 666. Uh, seven, number seven. That's, I'm not really going by number, but I read that first. Uh, 402, 352, 351, 350. Got two of those, 321, 310. Oh, we've got a small amount of 310. That's the smallest I've ever seen. And 208. All right, so I'm gonna switch these over and let me take a quick look to see what's going on. So 15 looks like it's supposed to be this light color right here. Oh, right there, which is what this color looks like. Kind of like a skin tone. And I'm gonna see where this H falls. Oh my gosh, honey, you're huge. <laughs> Let's see where H falls. You guys might see it before I do. Oh, here it is. All right, so H looks like it is a skin tone. And maybe even part of the hair as well. Up here in the corner. I'm limited in hand usage, so I'm trying to like show you guys so i may have to reach out to um miss lola rose i'm not sure if that's the actual name of the owner or the just the name of the business there's some more h's there which looks like the hair like i said let's see if it's in the face as well yep see some in the nose and near the mouth I forgot what that part of the, the lip is called. Just between the lip, the top lip and the nose. All right. Oh, and the neck. All right, so I'm gonna see how many baggies of this color I'm supposed to have. And um, yeah, just kind of see what happened there. Uh, and let's also look for the AB, which is Z, which I believe was that peachy skin tone. Z, Z, Z. It's going to take me a minute. Oh, I see a, I see one Z, <laughs> one Z. 
uh, Z, I just had it. Do, do, do. Couple right here, some here. Again, I think that's in the hair. So I believe they're kind of sporadic in the hair, which is great, I think. I saw some over here. Oh, right here. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Any eyes, maybe? That's the great thing about drill painting. You can kind of make it your own and, you know, add accents and change up some colors if you want to. If you feel, you know, maybe it could add a little bit more sparkle and shine somewhere else. But I, I love it. Like I said before, I think it's a beautiful canvas that they did. Where is it? That is legally licensed, like it says um, on the little sticker here. So I think that's great. Um, sorry, I was just looking in the earring to see if there were any. Uh, I might put a little bit uh, ABs, maybe even in the earring hoop. Who knows? We'll see. So what do you guys think? I think you guys already know what I think. I can't say enough how beautiful I think this canvas is. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'm kind of trying to pull everything out and put it back <laughs> here, even, even these two. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, criticisms, anything at all that you feel um, is necessary, please put them in the comments and I will read them and respond or react to them the best way that I possibly can, if with an emotion or just... Uh, a comment of whatever of any sorts uh, so with that hope you guys have a good rest of your day whatever part of the day you're watching this and i will see you in the next one bye hi everyone so i'm just popping in here real quick to show you something that i noticed uh while i was looking over my drills because i had noticed these two colors were different vastly different and I was just about to take a picture and send an email when I wanted to check over all of them to make sure that all of them were good. And I noticed in this row in particular that oops, there's just, there's just a lot going on. So on top of looking at this, seeing that it is two drastically different colors, I went ahead and looked for other possible issues and I came across nine. I didn't notice it when I was reviewing it that after 15 came nine. And when I compared it to the nine at the beginning, it is, uh, it's a shade or so off from the nine at the beginning. And then I saw here that the 15 on this end, or excuse me, this end, looks to be the same shade as this nine like they could be twins and then 11 is also the same way where it's two different colors same number but it looks like the next number in sequence looks similar to the one next to it or at least in this row anyway so yeah these these could be these could be identical twins. Let me see if these. No, that that's a that's a vast difference. Actually, nine and ten look similar too. Oh no! <laughs> there we go. Oh. Wow. Nine and ten look similar, very similar. Yeah. Um, so I am going to see if I can just get a whole new strip. I, I'm and maybe except for 13 and 14. It, but yeah. I I don't know. 
This is a new one. This I've never experienced this before. And I, I won't say this, that there won't be times where things are just a little bit different or maybe something's happened. I looked over the like all the, the paper inclusions in the kit and nothing really said that the you know some diamonds are supposed to be mixed with others to kind of give just a different effect and I guess I, I just want to know what's going on or what I need to do or if at least just this strip can be replaced I'll let you guys know what is the update on this particular kit. Again, this is Bohemian Soul. All right, so I will fill you in and update you later on. Until then. Hi everyone, so I'm back. I wanted to give you an update on the drills that came in the unboxing for Bohemian Soul from Lola Rose. And quick backstory, I, when I noticed the um, differences in the drills, and made that first follow-up, I went ahead, took pictures, and sent them um, to, or sent them through the email that stated that the order was on the way, and just kind of confirmed with them, hey, I did purchase this, and I'm not trying to pull one over on you, and let them know what the issue was. Messaged them on a Monday, Hadn't heard from them, so I kind of went into panic mode because I went on the website and saw that when you receive your order, go ahead and look at it because after 30 days, we're not responsible for any messed up drills. So I'm like, oh no, maybe they're just not responding because of that. And so I went ahead and reached out to um, Diamond Painting um, Besties or with Besties and reached out to her and said, hey, I saw that you unboxed the Bohemian Soul kit, and I'm just wondering if you still have it. So me and her kind of went um, back and forth. She was like, I found my kit, but I don't have the drills. I got to find them. But she was able to look at the drills. I, I, made, I put them in a separate bag. Um, and she's like, these two look, the DMC, for example, 11, looks to be a skin tone. So that that looks correct and pretty much was able to help me only to have Lola Rose reach back out to me and say hey uh we I forgot what they said but pretty much hey we're we're sorry we didn't respond right to, uh, to you right away <laughs> your email went to our spam folder so they went ahead and looked at another kit and I believe um there was there may have just been an issue with mine so they went ahead and sent me drills but the thing about this is um they they sent me a whole new bag like of of drills and in my email i did just ask for replacement of these but i i guess they were like you know what let's go ahead and just send uh the drills here um so that's what i have and looks like they did a they actually checked off each and every one i did not do that <laughs> but i'm gonna go ahead and just confirm this here oh no the sun's going down i don't want to turn my light on hopefully the lighting in here is pretty good uh so that i can see the um to see which one of these matches with these and i see right here at the front um the correct drill so um let's go ahead and take a look at these so we're just gonna start here at the beginning. So it looks like nine or seven twelve. They look. Oh, see, we're com we're not conforming, and I'm I'm okay with that. <laughs> so nine here. I keep calling it nine, but at least in sequence seven twelve. And I'm gonna pull these out. Oops, seven twelve looks like it matches. Looks like these match. I don't know why I have this one. I'm gonna sit that off to the side. I don't want that getting mixed in. Okay, so these two matched. Nine and 10 on here matched. So they match with these, these nines here. 
So these two go together. And I'm not going to pull these apart just in case I get confused again. So this 10 does not match this 10. This 11 looks like it matches with this 10. Yes? No? I'm going to go out on a limb and say yes. So the, these two match. Um, what is this? Well, this is 21. You don't belong here. You're not, you can't sit with us. All right, so these 11s match. And it looks like these match with this 11 and 12. So I'm going to say that is a match. So those two go together. And who do I have left? Um, 12 didn't, oops, knock into that. 12? 13 and 14. Huh. Oh, I didn't realize these were off either. Wow. I think I got too much stuff going on in the background. So 12 here. Um, so. Oh, wow. Okay. So the 12 in this row is the 13 for this one. The 14 in this, the 13 in this row is the 14 for this one. And come here. The 15 in the first one is the 14 for this one. My goodness, my goodness, my goodness. And I have two more left, which is the 15 and the 9 that matched. I'm going to say that they match for the 15, 15s here. Put those side by side or in close proximity to each other. Yeah. Okie dokie doke. So... The 15 and the 9 match with these two. Um, I'm going to go back to the beginning. Why is this warm? Oh, it's probably my heated blanket underneath. <laughs> that is really weird. Why is this warm? Okay. So, actually, let's see. I'm going to do this. I have <laughs> some rubber bands here. So I'm gonna band together the colors that belong to each other. So the nine, the nine and the 10 here from the original go together. I mean, it's common sense, but it's just confirmation. So I'm gonna put this back in the bag. And the, so that's that. The 10, is the 11 for here. Okay, I don't need to put that in a bag or a rubber band. Um, the 11s and 12s match with the 11s here. Stretch and stick together. I'm gonna do one quick fix here and put the number that corresponds with the DMC code in front. Okay. Yes, 11 is in front. Okay. And then I have one more. Oh, so then the corresponding color for 15 is 15. So I'm gonna put this together. Okay, so I think that is it. I should have, what was that orange one? Oh, here it is. Okay. And then I'm gonna kind of get it, get this stuff together when I actually start working on it. I haven't, 
haven't gotten around to starting this just yet because I wanted to make sure that everything was as it should be. And I'm not confusing or mixing up baggies and colors and such. So I, I do want to say a huge thank you to Lola Rose for getting back to me and responding because I was afraid that they were going to say, we're sorry, you're out of the 30 days uh, for us to help you. Um, and I was going to be highly upset, but that that is a business. Um, they can really do whatever they want, and that's totally fine. Um, but I do, I'm going to stop crinkling, but I do, I do want to say thank you again to Lola Rose for reaching back out to me and letting me know and just sending me a whole new bag of drills. I didn't ask, like I said, a, for a new bag of drills. I just wanted a replacement for the, for the, um, the ones that were off. And, you know, I, I greatly appreciate this. Thank you. And also to, uh, Diamond Painting, um, with Besties for also responding to my, my message and just being, um, able to assist me in saying, Hey, this color looks like it matches with this color. I, I, she looked up the DMC code, which that's probably what I might do in the future. Uh, if this happens again, hopefully it doesn't with any company, not just this one. I, I want to say thank you to her as well, just for, for, um, taking the time to, to responding back to my, my messages. Cause I messaged her like in the middle of the day, it was like a day later when I hadn't heard back from Lola Rose and was like, well, I'm going to, I'm going to take the next route and ask someone else, um, just, just for a little help, just to help me match up. Like I said, the colors to the DMC code. So thank you to both parties. I really greatly appreciate it. And as always, can't wait whenever I get to this to start on it and work on it and just see the diamond painting come come together. So with that, this is the update for the Lola Rose Bohemian Soul Diamond Kit. If you have any questions, comment, cons comments or concerns, criticism, anything like that, please leave, in the, leave them in the comments and I will definitely respond or reply or give uh, in any way possible that I can. And until then, until the next one, have a great one, you guys. And, you know, stay safe out there, whatever part of the year this in. It's cold where I am, but, you know, stay safe, stay warm, stay hydrated and all that stuff. And have a good one. Bye.